Come on, Linda. Silly Billy can't protect you. No one can. Chili, Linda can't hear you. She's a fictional character. Whoa! Hmm, what could it be? Maybe a chunk of ice that formed on the wing of a jet? Or something really gross. <laughs> It's not frozen toilet water. It's a spaceship! Spaceship? Disguised as a rock? Yep, it's brilliant, really. Aliens invade Earth disguised as insects. They infest our skin, drive us mad, then turn us into blobs. Insects? Really? How about we stop guessing what it is and actually study it? I think it's a meteorite. Agreed. It fell from the sky, making this crater. So let's do more research into the meteorite hypothesis. Already on it. I looked into meteor showers. There was one last night. What about researching my aliens among us hypothesis? Chili, no one thinks that rock is a spaceship piloted by evil insects. Ugh. Ugh. Why am I so itchy? Me too. Oh no! What's with my face? This is how it begins. The alien insects are making us their homes. Guys, all I want to do is go home, get some anti-itch cream, and take a bath. Who else is leaving? That's exactly what the aliens want. For us to spread our alien spores and plant our alien infection everywhere. Spores? Plant? That's it. Isaac, pull up video of the crater on the big monitor. Okay. Freeze. See the plants around the crater? Three leaves. Uh-oh. Leaves of three. Let it be. It's poison ivy! <laughs> We were right. It was a meteorite. And we made the news. Too bad we are covered in anti-itch cream in every photo. And I was right. We were under attack, but not from space insects, but from plants. Thank you very much. You can't trust the plants. Thank you for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe.